teenager is dead and two others hospitalized after an early morning crash. 4029's Paige Proisey is live in Springdale. Paige, tell us what happened. Well, I'm just off Emma Street here where five teenagers were involved in this deadly crash. Police say alcohol was a factor. It was a lot of blood. Desmond Johnson says he got a call around 4 a.m. Monday morning to tow away this damaged car on Meadow and Commercial. A car police say was full of five teens before it flipped several times and crashed. Two passengers were ejected, including 18 year old Alicia Landa Zamora, who's now dead. The other, 18 year old Ruth Figueroa, who's in the hospital with serious injuries. Everybody was speechless. The cops, including myself and my colleagues, we was all speechless. Police say two other passengers fled the scene. One of them, Ricardo Meza, who's now in the hospital. The other is in police custody after detectives served him an unrelated warrant. The driver, 20 year old Gustavo Escalante, was unharmed, but charged with battery, second degree, and negligent homicide. Police say he was drinking and driving. He had so much living to do, and just one split of second changed everybody's life. Johnson says this is the worst accident he's ever worked. I called my mom, I called my family, <laughs> and told them, you know, I love them. And, you know, I told my son, do not drink and drive because things like this can happen. Police say the car is registered to the suspect's mother. They're still out here investigating. Live in Springdale, Paige Froisey, 4029 News. And police aren't releasing the name of the other person who fled or saying what the warrant was related to. It's not illegal to flee the scene of an accident in Arkansas unless you're the driver.